Hey, on this date, instead of, you know, snapping away beautiful sunrises, we saw the Aurora Borealis as far south as Roosevelt Dam on this date in 1928. We're kind of starting to see colors today for a different reason. When we look at these piping hot temperatures that are coming our way, now this is actually very typical for this time of year for us to hit the highest marks in the year. You could see that on average, the hottest days out of the year for Phoenix land between the end of June and mid-July. And here we are July 7th. So same thing for Flagstaff. Right now it's typically the hottest for you and and Prescott. Now, Tucson, usually you're kind of exiting your hottest stretch because monsoon usually swoops in to save you. But uh, monsoon, where are you? We'd all like to know, right? Not just the hottest temps of the year coming at us, but we're actually going to be rivaling some historic heat waves. So the record for the most back-to-back 110-degree -back days is 18, and that was locked in in 1974. We're taking that on. Then, when you look at another historic heat wave in 1995, this had warmer mornings. So you had an average temperature when you take the morning lows, the afternoon highs. It was 98 degrees or hotter. That set a record 15-day stretch. And then July 2020 wasn't far behind that record. So we are going to be taking those historic heat waves on. Needless to say, if you are taking part in World Chocolate Day today, you better enjoy that sweet treat quickly because it's going to be getting gooey in the mountains. Yes, even the places we go to escape the heat, you're also above average in your record highs. And for the valley, we're just talking fondue in a flash. If you are going to be heading out this weekend to any one of these great events, be ready with the shades, the sunblock, all of it, and make sure you're staying hydrated. In Concho at Red Rock Ranch, you have the Lavender Bloom and Wine event, 97 degrees is your custom forecast. 101 for the Blackberry Festival at Mortimer Farms in Dewey. We're still stretching out that sunshine and watch out Glendale Christmas in July. Wow with 113. Yeah, that'll have you dreaming of Christmas. 112 in Lake Havasu for the red, white, and blue skate party. We'll be dialing down during the time of that event, uh, which is from 7 to 10. And then 93 degrees is the high today in Prescott. If you're getting out there to Courthouse, the Summer Concert Entertainment Series is going to be going on there at 630. So as advertised here, you know, you need the sunblock. Our UV index is extreme right now. You don't have to worry too much about the bugs or the allergies, although weeds kind of an issue and so is the grass. So this weekend's hot enough, right? Look at next week. I mean, Wednesday especially, we will be all eyes on the thermometer, Stella.